Hi there, I'm Lexi Fife, or as CJ called me, the legendary Lexi Fife. I don't know about the legendary part, but I kind of liked it. Alliteration, I like alliteration. Legendary Lexi, never mind. Okay. So anyways, <laughs> this is episode five of Hot Tag for the Milo Beasley Show. Woo! Party! And I have with me, let's see if I can say this correctly, Selena de la Renta. She said it better than me. Did I, I say it even, nicely? I, I was can't kinda, even correct I rolled my, I rolled it and, I, and it sounded sexy. No, Selena I did. It sounded way Rente. better than how I say it. Mmm. Yeah. Makes me, yeah. 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 Maybe I have some like Latin. Maybe you should teach me Spanish. Know. Yeah, there you go. That would be awesome. You should be my teacher. Yeah, so I'll, I'll teach you some Spanish. I only know cuss words. You do? Do you? Yeah. <laughs> Just a couple of them. So, um, so hot tag is where I'm going to ask you a series of questions that have already been asked other people, and we're going to just see what you answer. Okay. All right. Are let's you ready? Do it. I'm you ready. Know nothing about this, right? Okay. I have no idea. Here what we it go. Is. Question number one: Who was your first celebrity crush? Zac Efron. Uh, you can tell she's a lot younger than me if you watched my episode. <laughs> <laughs> Zac Efron. Okay, I can see that. I can see that. Yeah. yeah you gotta get a yeah. thing for a cute white boy. Yeah. Well, and he, I mean, his, his abs. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. I, know. I, I Yes. I yes. Know. All right. I got that. Convert I got you it. on that. I got you on that one. Okay. All right. Zac Efron. And he sings, too. He sings. And he, he dances. dances. Yeah. And he got those blue eyes, and he's yeah. so pretty. And he's really funny. Right. Yeah. Okay. I can totally he's see adorable. that. He's adorable. All right. Zac Efron, you need to hit her up, okay? Hey, yeah. just DM me or I'll yeah. send them digits over. There you go, there you go. All right, question number two. What's your favorite Guilty Pleasure song? Guilty Pleasure song. Come on, I embarrass myself. So um, you can embarrass yourself, it's okay. Okay, let me think. Because mm, I have a bad song, I can't say that way. Um, <laughs> that's, that's, okay. just, that's too bad. It's okay, it's only going on the internet too. Everyone. Exactly. No, this is terrible. <laughs> this is like the worst thing you could do to me. Okay. Um, um, do you want to whisper it? What song were you going to say? I was going to say... My dick. <laughs> I don't know if you can say that one. No, I can't say that. Uh, no, I can't no, say no, that. No, no, no. Pick a different one. No, no. That's my trainer's favorite song, too. So I can't put oh, it on the spot. Oh, my. Okay. Okay. All um, right. Maybe I'll tell you guys after she mm, leaves. Are you going to? No. <laughs> Might as well just say it then. <laughs> um, I guess... It could just be like Frozen songs and oh, like I'm, I'm from the movie Frozen. Yeah, like Let It Go, Let like It Let Go. Sing. Yeah, yeah. What, what's your favorite? Sing. What's your favorite? I love my voice. Oh, it's okay. Can you hum it? Can you do? Can yeah. you? Can you? Can you make? Frozen? I like the one. Like, that's like you, I like you, Love Is an Open Door. That oh, one. Okay. I like that okay. one. I like that song too. Yeah, I sing the the guy part, the girl part. Yeah. Sing the sandwich the, part. The I chocolate like the part. part. The sandwich part is hilarious. Yeah, I know, right? Yeah. So, you know, on, on the, um, the CDs, there's two that come in the, but, you know, nobody has CDs anymore. Nope. But I do, because uh, I'm old. So, you know, <laughs> so on the second CD is all the songs that didn't make the movie, and there's some really good ones on there. Have you ever listened to the side B? No. no oh, you need to. I'm only, to. like, I started watching the, the song videos on YouTube, uh -huh. and that's how I, I learned songs, because my sister's also, like, a big Frozen fan, mm -hmm. so... You gotta go to Disney and go on the ride. Oh, Have I do. That? Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. Well, me and Aria, that's where we live. We live at Disney. Okay. So. That's cool. That would be my dream to actually live at Disney. It's not really yeah. cool. No, I know. I, I, no, I would like to live right there on Main Street, like up in the second floor, like just live there. Well, it's me, I spend noisy. a lot of time there. Uh -huh. So I can tell you, it can be really annoying when there's like 10,000 people. Okay. Yeah, no. I, yeah. Yeah, and you're yeah. trying to just do a ride that you've done. 10,000 times. Right. But you, you can't do, do it. it. Mm -hmm. You can't mm -hmm. do it because it's yeah. like two hour wait. Fast passes. <sighs> Not very fast. Okay. <laughs> so we're getting off topic here. So, but you know, we get Disney addicts. What can That's we what do? That's what happens. Right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Disney. Question number three. Would you rather, okay, would you rather fight a horse sized duck, horse sized duck, okay, that's pretty or scary. 100 duck sized horses? I'm kind of curious about the hundred horses. Yeah? So like, you think you'd rather fight them? Now remember, you've got to fight them. So what do you think? okay. I mean, mm -hmm. so depends on how big the duck is, too, because uh -huh. is that horse-size duck I mean, just that's picture, huge? Just picture, like, a regular-size mallard, you know, like, I don't know, like, like a little tiny little no, horse? No, no, a little, you know, mallards are kind of tall, you know, and they're long, you know. A mallard duck, you know, the greenish 
But I mean, both of them don't do nothing. No, I got bit by a duck. You it did? Hurt. But yes. no, nobody says I got bit by a horse. I think people have gotten bit by horses before. But, but all right, so what is your like, final answer? Uh, I would fight. I don't like fighting animals. They're like you. Yeah. I fight people for a living. All right, but what if they so. were attacking you? What if, you know, what if either the one horse-sized duck was attacking you or the hundred... I guess I'll just, I'll just fight Big Bird, I guess. You just, just, fight, you just fight the big one? Yeah, because, I mean, why hurt 100 animals when I can just hurt one? <laughs> <laughs> I, like, said, I said that I didn't like the 100 ducks coming at me. Like, I thought like it was just, I mean, you know, the 100, the 100 little, little horses? horses that would be, I'm just like, curious you know, to see how they would look. I don't know. It would just be crazy. Yeah. So, yeah. I think horses would just run over you and the duck would, like, and your back like and like, or something. Yeah. yeah, I'd rather be run over. I, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> hey, wow. All right, here we go. Question number four. What's your favorite movie quote? Ha Has anyone seen the captain's balls? They're about this big, but a lot tinier. <laughs> they're like, they're like a pea or like a bull baron. They're like little girl balls. If little girl had balls, and then she brings Tic Tacs, so throws them at the balls. I found your balls. That's my favorite. That's your favorite? <laughs> <laughs> kind of reminds me of your favorite song. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> the one that you didn't want to say. <laughs> no. It's so, I, I just love that kind of joke. It's just, for me, it's hilarious. <laughs> That's Selena de la Renta. <laughs> It's definitely my favorite. I could think of something else, but I'm like, that's true. No, no, that's your favorite. That's your favorite. It's, it's from okay. The Heat. That's the best movie ever. Okay. All right. All right, here we go. Last and final question. Are you ready? Ready. Is Harry Potter a hero or actually just a giant <laughs> Dizik? He's a hero, I guess. I really don't want... I'd, I really don't watch Harry Potter movies. Yeah, we can um, no longer be friends. I, <laughs> I watched the movie, the first one, with mm -hmm. the big hairy dude. And um, for me, Harry Potter was like a student. I don't know. I, he might be a hero. I don't know. I know he did like, he, he, say, he got the Quidditch, to the he had a Quidditch ball that he saved yeah. with his mouth. That was so weird. Yeah. How do you remember that part? Okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> that reminds me of your favorite song again. <laughs> This, this is, is so getting, horrible. This is getting, this is very, getting this very bad. Is getting really, this, this is, is just PG I just anyway. buried myself. <laughs> if people <laughs> only knew what exactly we were talking about, this would have to be rated R. The Quidditch. So, Quidditch, I know. Is that that's correct, right? Yes. That is right. So yes. Fine. Okay. The books are better. Maybe you should try the books. I don't. The books are I, better. Well, I'd rather watch the movie. Okay. Well, then watch them. Because I hate reading. All right. Well, this brings us to the finale. So now I'm tagging out. You're going to have to find somebody to tag in. Okay. Bam. I've been bit by a duck before, and it's not fun. How did you get bit by a duck? Well, Feeding. I was stupid, and I decided I wanted to try and pick up one of its babies. Yeah, you don't do that to a duck, because they get really angry. What if someone tried to pick up your baby? I, well, yeah, I would probably bite them, too. But 